So the next one we're gonna do is we're gonna get into the bladder meridian. And the bladder meridian is a really great one to work because it's got all the neural lymphatic points on the back right along the meridian. So um, I remember when I worked with Dr. Thee in his clinic, if anyone had back pain, he would just stroke that bladder meridian over and over and over again. And it was like often that in itself would clear the, the back pain. So it's um, in the three to 5 p.m., some of you might be in that time zone right now, where um, the meridian starts right at the eye, on the inside of the eye. Bladder one is where your glasses would sit. So that bladder one goes straight up the back of the head and straight down the back. I think of it like a ladder. If you have one on each side and then the, the spine is, spinous processes, transverse processes are like the rungs of ladder. So bladder is like a ladder. Goes down and Right when you get to the bottom of the gluteal fold there, you go back up and then you come and trace from the area about T2 and you go down the center of the hamstrings and then down through the calf out to the little toe. So that is your bladder meridian. It's, got, it's the longest in the body. It's 67 points. And then your neural lymphatics are there's two sets. There's one just lateral to the navel and then off of L2 in the back. We're gonna focus mainly on the front ones today for self-correction. And then it's on the top of the pubic bone. So we're gonna rub those. And then you have uh, two sets, the neurovasculars, same as the uh, anterior fontanelle. And then you got ones right um, on the inside of the eyebrows. So let's do those now. So find your umbilicus and go just out to the side and like one inch out. And the way you can kind of remember it is um, you have the, the bladder is straight up from the umbilicus, kidney is one inch up and out from the umbilicus, and adrenals are two inches up and out from the umbilicus. We'll just work the, the bladder ones right now. But see, the bladder is lowest, then the kidney feeds the bladder, and the adrenals sit on top of the kidneys. So that's the way you can remember these. In fact, a good general rule of thumb is the higher the organ is in the body, the higher the neural lymphatic point. So the brain up on top has you know, C1 uh, in the back and then up here. And then heart and thyroid are kind of a little bit lower. They're here. And then lungs are just below that. You know? And then you got your stomach and your liver. They're below that. Then your small intestines, a little lower. That's down here. And then we've got, again, our adrenals. Um, the spleen and, and pancreas over here, and then your adrenals, kidney, and bladder. And then we also have the top of the pubic bone. So rub on the top of the pubic bone. You're also getting the reproductive organs here. So working that. Oh, yeah. And you'll find if there's a tender spot and you work a little longer, it will often go away. Okay, now our vascular points are frontal eminences and then the points right inside the eyebrow. You can do them both together if you like. Breathing deeply. Now the bladder meridian, you can get as much as you can. You're gonna start right again where your glasses sit on the eyes and you're gonna go up, right down the back, as far as you can. And when you get down to the gluteal fold, you come back up, T2, go down back as far as you can in the middle of each side of the back, down the middle of the hamstrings, makes a little flare out at the knee, and then goes middle of the calves, and then goes out to the little toe, the lateral part of the little toe, the nail there. That's bladder 67.